part two of the breaker block strategy. Similarly, in a bearish market, wait for a sweep of a low before price impulses up. This indicates a bullish reversal is incoming. Once that happens, draw out with a box the last candle that created the lower high. This is the bullish breaker block and where we will look to take our longs from. You can then set a buy limit at the breaker block and set SL at the recent low, targeting previous highs. Now that you know how to use the ICT breaker blocks, let's hop onto the charts to see how to use them. Here we have a 15 minute chart on pound dollar and we can see that price has created a manipulation of a high before impulsively selling off. So we mark out the bearish breaker block as our area to enter shorts from. Now all we have to do is set the sell limit at this bearish breaker block, put the SL at the recent high it created and target the new low it has formed. Let's see how it plays out. And after a while, as you can see, we have smashed TP.